Well, you know what I could do? I just realized. I guess I could just hop off my mount and be like, look, fast travel. <laughs> At this really weird fast travel spot. It's like 30 feet away. Uh, but, you know, we'll, we'll s still fast travel anyways. It'll save us time. He's probably going to want me to go to Oxenfurt. Um, we could do that, but I don't... I think we'll go there. Because there is a... Barber. And I think it's time for Geralt to get a haircut. I'm not saying... I'm just saying. Mm. Roach, get over here. I guess I could have summoned Roach when I was out on the road, but... I wanted to walk across the bridge on my own volition. It's cooler that way. In my head. But yeah, totally calling it. He's gonna be pissed off that I haven't found him yet. And... What do you want? Oh, I, land. Yeah, I saved him out of the fire. We'll never forget that. Here, yeah. I'm grateful. Hmm. Wow, twenty crowns. It's pretty good. Nice. What we ought to do? Uh, okay. We really ought to go up to Vizima. Is it Vizima? Velen? Vizima. That's the city, right? Um. I just get the quick travel point, but I don't want to do that because there's just like, oh, it's so overwhelming. You have so many quests that just are thrust upon you and you're like, ah, there's too much to do. Witcher, a word, please. Believe we've not had the pleasure. They call me the sergeant, left over from my army days, you understand. I do. When me and Philip meaning the Baron, served under a Temerian banner. Wanted to ask you about something. Uh, what's it? What is it? That night when the Baron ordered everyone to lock their doors, stay inside. What did you and the Baron do? Party. Gotta ask the Baron about that. Speaking of which, know where he is. Garden. Spends a lot of time sitting there of late. Drunk. No. Don't drink, don't eat. Just sit. That is the sign of a man who has his conscious weighing heavily upon him and knows he's made mistakes. There you are. See the hollyhock there? The violet blooms. Brought the plants here from Nazaire. Anna had read some story. Insisted on having them. Spent hours tending to them, trimming, pruning. She was so content at that. And them, the frilly ones, called birds of paradise in Zeracania. But Tamara called them dragons of paradise. She adored them. Damn shame I'll never learn which blooms would please Daya most. Oh, it's good to know her spirit's free. Yeah, death of family member is always hard. Your loss. It must hurt. Bad. But there wasn't anything we could do. No. Not now. Not anymore. It was too late. That was clear. Should have acted earlier. Taken them all from this damned villain. In this hole. This reesty mire. Nothing could go right here. I want to talk about your family. Got some information about your family. You've learned something? Well, let's go inside. It's a bit chilly out. Any news for me? Your daughter's in Oxenford. That was weird. What the blazes? Is she alright? In good health, safe. Why haven't you brought her back? Never offered to do that. <laughs> How do you know she's safe? You see her at least? No, but I talked to the man who helped her escape and then took her in. Tamara is safe and sound. From what I gathered, she has no desire to see you again, no intention to return. I shan't trust some peasant dolt. I shan't trust whoever it is helped her. 
I need to know for certain she's safe. Go to her. You must be sure. See her yourself. I shan't believe anyone else. Uh, fine. That much I can do. I'm grateful. Take this. Call it enticement. And this might prove useful. What is it? A letter of safe conduct. Ever since the Redanians took hold of the Pontar Delta, they made it damned hard to get to Novigrad without one. Very well. You were to find them both. What of Anna? Learned anything? Nothing yet, but I'm on her trail. Well, what are you waiting for? For you to tell me about Ciri, like we agreed. <sighs> Fine. A word once given. When Ciri was on the mend, we took her out on a hunt. Thought a bit of galloping would warm up her limbs, gone stiff from so much bed rest. Yay, a Siri moment. With a really bright white screen. <laughs> I do like the Siri things. Of yours. Pure luck in the flesh. To hunt down a wild boar that size. Why, worthy of one of King Faltest's feasts, were he still among the living. Siri, come! Our haunt should be yours as I see it. Oh, you done well, lass. Not bad. Not bad at all. But who goes boar hunting with a sword? No bow at hand, no spear. My sword was all I had. <laughs> well, you brandished it beautifully. Where'd they teach you that, anyway? Uh... Would... Now, Siri isn't my character. She doesn't follow the same rules as Geralt. Would she reveal that she's a, a witcher? I mean, it's pretty obvious, right? Yeah. At Care Morhen. Witcher school there, are you? But they only took lads, as I recall. Uh, I'm the exception? Oh, she's not a witcher. Is she not a witcher? I mean, she's pretty much a witcher, right? They made an exception for me. Right. Mean to say you're a she-witcher? Not entirely. The mutations, I was never subjected to them. But everything else I know, I learned from the witchers there. Know any of them potions? Not so much. A bit. Because you see, at times I get this pinching back here. <laughs> Shut it, Egrin. Nobody cares about your backside. A woman could swing a sword. I've knowed one. But never seen a lady mount anything but a cock proper. All tipsy on horseback. Nothing strange on account they bloody mount them sideways. Perhaps you'd care to wager? Think you can outrun me on an horse? <laughs> Naturally. What's the stake? Black Mare. The one in the stable. Oh, that won't do at all. Uh, coward? What happened? You get the jitters? No. <laughs> <laughs> so why not? The horse is mine. To race the Baron himself. I'd consider it an honor. <laughs> oh, that'd be a sight to behold. Would it ever? Done. But if I win, I take your sword. Damn. Agreed. I'd not drink any more this night. You'll want your head about you. And we start at daybreak. <laughs> the race is on. I'm a fan of racing, so that'll that'll be fun. I just I'm not I'm not a fan of horse racing. You know, there's different kinds of racing. And if you're a racing fan, you know exactly what I'm talking about. But I mean, I'm not really good on a horse. Siri, what have you done? <laughs> that rabbit. The day dawns. Ready? As ever, first one to the tower. Man chop! Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Come on, Siri. Three, Don't you two, us? one. Boop. Go, go, go. Don't you? 
Oh, I'm gonna go that way. There we go. The horse wasn't running for whatever reason. I just gotta keep an eye on the mini map. Cause that, wow, there were monsters up there. That will show me, you know, where I need to go. Cause in order to win, you need to be able to take the uh, apex of the corners. Not that it matters on a horse. And winner. Your wind, not woman. <laughs> Worthy of the best horse. The mare is yours. Thank you. She's so happy. What? Oh. Something is coming. Another chance to win. <laughs> She does one-liners. I think I'm in love. I think I'm in love. <laughs> I, I, I just, I got nothing to say to that. That's just perfect. <laughs> she screamed like a mad woman. In an instant, all had forgotten the wager. Every man ran to save his skin, even worried to break his neck. And they make it? Some, aye. Others were not so fortunate. But what happened then? I must say, Witcher, seen a lot, but nothing like this. Never. Uh oh, I know that look. You're a fast learner. You'll know the rest once you find my wife. Damn you. Working on it. And making piss poor progress. They split up. Hadn't considered that possibility before. But don't worry. I'll find Anna, too. <laughs> okay, so we just had this massive, like, emotional quest line with him. And then we're, we're talking about Siri, and, you know, then it's getting into the, the kind of, like, Witcher um, not emotions, but Geralt kind of has, like, a weird, like, emotional attachment to her because he's kind of, or she's kind of her, his daughter kind of thing. And then we come back to talking about his family and why I need to go find him. And my first option is, hey, let's play some Gwent. <laughs> no. So long. Okay. Uh, first things first, right? I actually want to check my journal first. So the in series footsteps is kind of like our main quest. That's that's what we're doing. So we've got hunting a witch. We have family matters. So this is going to find Tamara. Uh, investigate all remaining leads in Velen. Find the Baron's wife. Okay, wow. This is a long quest line that we've been on. Hunting a witch sounds fun. But I think we'll do family matters first. Um, we got a couple secondary quests that are within our range. But man, our witcher contracts are nowhere near. Oh, and we got more money. 281. That's not bad. Um, we actually have quite a bit of money. But if we got to Vizima, we could trade it in at the bank. Because, and I've shown this before, but just as a reminder, as a refresher, um, if I can find it. See, you have the Florins and then the Orins. And the basically, you know, you just have to exchange them, and it's it's got like a weird exchange rate. I don't remember exactly the number on it, but it, it gets you normal money. White Witcher! When you find my daughter, will you give her this? A rag doll. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. That's it? Cool. Whatever. Uh, Roach. Oh, I saw him appear this time. Oh, look how majestic Roach is. With the, the sun beaming down upon our... Amazing horse. I love it. I love it so much. Okay, let's get to the gate and we will fast travel off closer to Oxenfort. Fort? Oxenfort? And we'll go over there. I, I figure we'll do this quest and then we'll jump on the Hunting a Witch quest. Uh, which also has a very depressing part to it, but that's not for quite some time. So we have some, some happiness before we get to the depression again. Uh, we're not that far off, though. Got that 
Lost his wit like an Elvin Rad whore. You surprised? They tried to dance with a witcher. Where'd he come from anyway? Well, how should I know? You so curious? Ask him yourself. Yeah. Ask me. Oh, I want it. Thank you. <laughs> Use the thing. Right, we haven't gone any of this direction, but we will, so I'm not concerned. We haven't gone any of this direction. Once again, we will. Uh, we'll explore all this soon. So I feel like... Uh, I feel like if we go... Okay. Consulting the map. <laughs> right, because the most efficient way to clear the zone is to go over to places as I see them. So like, you know, this is our quest that we're going to do right now. We're going to we're going to head this direction. However, if we travel to either one of these places, then on our way this direction, we should clear out everything, right? Like there's I mean there's there's a quick travel point here and here. Uh there's one like up here. And there's several within the the little Oxenfort uh area right there. So I, I think I should just kind of go like dee, 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 right and just like get all of this and maybe hook back like this it, it feels like it's going to be a couple episode journey but I think it's going to be worth it just to kind of you know we clear out this island maybe even getting like all this down here would be good too maybe maybe go up oh gosh I don't know we should go here first right because there's a fast travel point so we'll go here I'm just, I'm trying to plan it out so I know what the best way to do that is. It might be, it might be more efficient to go south, but I'm not sure. There's roach, 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 roach. Where are you going? Why are you? Here. Roach. Oh, okay. He got it. He got there eventually. Slower. Right. <laughs> it's going to crack me up every time. So let's go over there. Um, what game time is it? 4.57 a.m. Bright and early. Girl's getting... Uh, ooh, I'm going the wrong direction. Girl's getting getting started early. Because it's a day for adventure. It's a day for exploration. It's a day for clearing markers on his map. As he slowly heads off over to Oxenford. For oxen fort. I don't know why I keep saying fort. That's not. It's fort. Not fort. The devil's pit. That's easier. Ooh, and I got a new quick travel marker right there. Why am I. Why, thank you. <laughs> why? I don't understand why it actually had me walking. I don't think I hit control at any point there. Okay. Uh, well, Quen. Let's just look around real quick. Ooh, there's loot. I should probably mention that. Uh, we're at 46 of 90, but there's a new patch coming. The 1.7 patch. And what they're doing is they're kind of reworking how the inventory works a bit. So I obviously don't have that yet because of the fact that the patch isn't out yet from when I'm recording this. But I do know that it's upcoming, and I do know that I'm not going to really have to worry about my inventory right away. Um... Because, like, all the crafting materials and stuff I don't think are taking up spaces. Like, weight on your... On your inventory. Alright, it's time to wreck some face. Burn! I, I guess I could... Uh, no. Uh, yeah, I'll shield. Did I just see a bow guy? No. Seeing things. I'm paranoid. Being... Bowed. Burn. I could just pretty much whack at him here. Oh, that was gross. It's like a big slash in him. No, no, no. Don't fall. Don't fall. Oh, jeez. Oh, dear. Come, come at me. That's another thing coming in the next patch, by the way. It's a new control system for Daryl. That seems interesting. I'm, I'm curious because... You know, in RPGs, I don't necessarily care about how the character is, like, controlled. Like, if it's a little clunky, it's kind of annoying sometimes, but it's forgivable. But 
you know, in situations like Dragon Age, where you are oftentimes having to put yourself in very specific situations with, like, you know, pausing and tactical cam and all that, and then movement should be... Why are you attacking that way? Movement should be fairly accurate. But games like this, like, the combat is smooth, and I don't really care about the general movement in the game, usually. Even though I think I've recently raged about that. Look, it doesn't matter. You know what I'm trying to say. I don't know why I keep attacking this guy twice. Too much talking. Not enough stabbing. Um, did I kill everybody already? I, what are these dead bodies doing? <laughs> he, is, he is all wonky. Oh, give me the loot. Give me it all. Turn Turn around. Thank you. Okay. Uh, some more over here. Probably don't need to be looting all this. But it kind of feels good right now. I literally painted the wall red there. The texture's all weird. <laughs> Love it. I hear a pig. Can I... Ooh. Can I kill the pig? I don't really want to. I'm just kind of curious if I can. So I'm going to try. That was really sad, actually. But I got pork. Totally worth. Oh, oh, I just drank some type of alcohol. Let's go to my food. Um, food. Food? Which one's food? This one? Yeah. Let's not drink my alcohol. Whoa. It's all trippy. <laughs> Can I put some, like solid food in him. Will it wear it off a little quicker? Is there any other loot? Not really. Wow, this is actually getting me kind of motion sick. <laughs> Nothing. Oop, it's a deserter. Oh, there he is. You know, that alcohol went through his system really quickly. I'm just saying. He, he like downed a full bottle within a second. And suddenly, it's not affecting him anymore. Actually, it wouldn't affect him right away anyways. It would take a little bit, but... Jeez. Oh, that's so gross. It's the, uh, you know what it is. What's my inventory at? I gotta keep an eye on that. 48. Uh, it's not what it was just at. I'm kind of confused. I don't have the patch installed yet, and yet I'm feeling the... I guess none of this weighs too much. Anyways. The physics stuff is really weird and gross sometimes uh, with dead bodies, but a, a little too real. Give me it all. Can I jump? That works too. Right, can I go up this ladder? I bet you there's loot. I see enemies on the map. Oh, no, no, I don't want to go back down the ladder. If anybody was observing this from like, you know, like off over there, like if there's any of these deserters still left alive, but like these guys, they were probably wondering what the heck I was doing there. Ow, ow. I wasn't expecting that. I actually thought I had to point out. I like that I looted pork from this. That's good. I wonder if I kill him with fire if it's cooked pork. Oh my gosh, I gotta try that next time. Next time I see pigs. Gotta return my weapon again, too. It actually does less damage when it's kind of broken like this. Die, die. Burn. I got him stuck in the wall. That was weird. He's dead. Oof, well, now he's dead. I. Why did his, like, punch just take off, like, three quarters of my health? Holy crap. You know what? You deserve that, guy. I need to buy food or something because, jeez, I'm just, like, eating through this stuff. There are... His <laughs> hand is moving. It's so creepy. <laughs> Why is his legs moving? Oh, gosh. Can I get in there? Not locked. Okay, that's cool. Right, uh, is there an easy way down? No. 
Did I? Gosh, I hate how the camera like slingshots back around. I didn't loot that. I'm okay with with the slingshot now because it actually did reveal that to me. Uh, is there a way down that way? There is, but there I could just go down this way, so it doesn't matter. Drink another water. That's 20 seconds of regeneration. That's actually pretty good. I know there's loot there, but I know there's a guy over there. Uh, no, get around the post. We'll flail your skin off. That was dark. Let's just let him touch his do my dance. There's gotta be a better way to fight these guys, but this is the, this is my way, and it feels right. It, it feels like some of the weird things that people do in fighting games that like cancels animations of abilities, but still has the ability to go off. You know, you, I just, it's really hard to describe. I, I think there's like, like a technical technical term for it, but I'm not like a fighting game guy, so I don't really know. All I know is I've seen it happen, and it's crazy. It's crazy to watch people do also like weird combos and switching in and out and just a ton of weird stuff like that on like Marvel vs. Capcom. A game that I actually grew up with. Believe it or not, arcades were a thing <laughs> at one point, and I remember going down to an arcade. It was like the local arcade fairly often with a ton of friends. And I would get whooped at Marvel vs. or uh, Capcom. <sighs> oh my gosh. Marvel vs. Capcom. Um, I would also get whooped at like Police Academy. <laughs> at like a light gun game. But you know what? You know what game I was actually pretty good at? Tekken. For whatever reason, Tekken was like my jam. And so was Metal Slug. Really good with Metal Slug. And Pinball. Also, another really weird, like, if if I wasn't doing YouTube, I'd be like a pro pinball player. I don't know. Something weird like that. Where did those burnt bodies even come from? It doesn't make any sense. Can I get into there? Nope. Well, it appears we cleared out this area, even though I'm pretty sure there's a quest here. I think. Like in the future ish I guess because you clear it out and then I assume people move in have I not cleared everything out there's like a thing over here it says down what what is it oh it's a chest Ooh. grave hog decoction hag I can't talk tonight it's done I'm done I'm over I'm at the end of my rope with talking. Did I take all that damage from falling? I think I did. Oops. Uh, it doesn't appear that I can go into there. I don't see any extra enemies. I do see a bit of loot here. Take that. Uh, there's one above me. Oh my gosh, get around the pillar. Getting body blocked by a pillar. I will loot this real quick. Should have done that earlier. I kept looking at it too. I knew it was up here. Ran by it like six or seven times. Okay, well. Can I get into here? No, nope, locked. I assume people are just gonna move in, right? So, I guess from here, do we decide to go south or do we decide to go north? Um, I mean, we'll. We'll end up going up this way anyways, so I think I think south. I believe south is the direction we shall go. I just need Roach not to be hiding over there. Alright, how much money do I have and how much space do I have? I have almost no space and I'm running quickly out of money. Maybe south is not the wisest plan. Nope, it's the wise plan. I'm doing it. I've decided. I've already made my decision. It's happening. Did I just hear... I thought I heard like like a giant bird, like big wings flapping. Slower. Were this wolves or was that a griffin? Oh no. I'm kind of scared. Uh, That's it, Roach. You know what? I'm just gonna go straight to my marker. 